Who's the corpse? The stick. The stick. Who's the stick? Oh, who, who, who is it? Wait, 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 wait. Anybody? Oh, Anna. Right. Anna Politskovskaya. What does she do? What does she do? What did she do? She was a writer. She was a writer. Right. You think we could kill them all off? The world needs another Russian writer, really? Dostoevsky didn't do enough, huh? Okay. okay. Writer, writer. Where did she go? Where did she go? Oh! Chechnya. Chechnya. Nya, 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 nya! Chechnya! Where the hell is Chechnya? Anyone? No. No, I don't think it's fine. So, Chechnya. What happened there? Oh, right. Anna went to save people. So nice. She went to save people. The Chechen War. Okay, 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 okay. Let's see this war. Yep. I will show you Anna's. Yeah. 
a lie once. It's only a lie. Tell a lie ten times. You're a prophet! Yes, right! Make a friend, you've got a friend. But make an enemy. You've got endless movies!
There's something wrong, too, in the measured way Muhammad relates the story of what happened to him. In the course of Zajit's justice, he was subjected to the same electric torture as the grown men. In the morning, on the 29th of January, Lassie Yishayeva went into labor. Lassie's relatives went to ask military men who were standing in the nearest encampment to put the threatening woman in the ass. They had been in the mouth for a long time. The woman loudly shamed them. They said he also had mothers, wives, sisters. But they answered that they arrived here to kill those who are alive. Not to help those who are giving birth. So they, be, so they began to negotiate that vehicle. And again, time passed away. Finally, Lies was brought to a hospital. But since there, entirely other soldiers stood. They pinned down the enraged driver and right into the wall, like a fighter who's been captured. Lies endured the wall for some time. And then she began to faint. Soon, baby was born, but it was dead. How secure we feel with an army where every week soldiers desert and throw, sometimes whole squads at a time, and even entire campaigns? What do you think of an army in which a single year, a complete battalion more than 500 men, have been killed, not by any fire, but by beating? End of story. Tragedy. Жестокость, равнодушие, цинизм. Все беженцы из Чечни делятся на две группы. Одни ненавидят русских и всех, кто приехал из Москвы. Другие, напротив, лояльны. И без общего дома с Россией жизни своей будущей не представляют. Когда и те, и другие начинали рассказывать о нищенском положении дома престарелых Грозном, о бомбах, которые сыплются на него, а значит и на головы сотни стариков и старушек. Все беженцы оказывались едины в оценках. Что вы, вы, русские, вообще можете хорошего сделать, если даже своих стариков из-под бомб вытащить не способны? The infanticides have never had to stand where they belong, in the dock. The army continues to rage in Chechnya, as it was allowed to at the beginning of the war, as if its operations were being conducted on the training ground in St. Petersburg. This massacre of the innocents did not raise a storm in Russia. Not one television station broadcast images of the five little Chechens who had been slaughtered. The Minister of Defense did not resign. The Commander-in-Chief himself made no speech of condolence. <laughs> Это история, трагедия, жестокость, равнодушие, цивилизм. Все беженцы и чечни делятся на две группы. Одни ненавидят русских и всех, кто приехал из Москвы. Другие напротив, лояльны. И без общего дома с Россией жизнь свою уже не представляют. Когда и те, и другие
Thank mm-hmm. you. 